On this Aviation Special, we sit down with VTech and Xterity talking about the acquisition, what it means for clients, and what it means for dealers. All that and more next on this Aviation Special. The network for the AV industry. What are you listening to? This. This is AV. This. This. This is AV Nation. Nation. This is AV Nation. This is an Aviation special. VTech acquires exterior. Mr. Marbury with Aviation with an Aviation special taking a look at a merger and acquisition that came our way about a month or so ago. Uh, real quickly, v- uh, VTech has acquired uh, Xterity to create, quote unquote, uh, the global uh, IPTV and digital signage powerhouse from the, the release itself. VTech, a worldwide leader in IP video streaming solutions today, announced the strategic acquisition of Xterity Limited, the award-winning market leader, provide, market leading provider of integrated IPTV digital signage and user engagement technologies. With us to talk about this merger and acquisition, first and foremost, an old friend of, of this program and of Aviation, Colin Farker uh, from Xterity. Welcome, sir. Hi, Tim. Good to see you again. Good to see you, bud. Uh, and also with us, uh, a gentleman I got to meet today, uh, Mark uh, Diadio, uh, Senior VP for VTech. Welcome, sir. Nice to meet you, Tim. Nice to meet you, bud. Uh, so let's, let's you know, merchant acquisitions, not uncommon in, in the space. Um, certainly, you know, from an economic standpoint and an economist, economist standpoint, we, we expect to see a number of these throughout 2021 and quite frankly into 22 uh, as the, 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 the dust settles from uh, the pandemic. Uh, this one, though, is is, is interesting, again, because we, we've known Colin for a long time. We've known Xterity for a long time. Certainly, we're familiar with, with VTech. So, Mark, we'll, we'll start with you on this. From VTech's standpoint uh, and your leadership as well as, as your customers, why does this merger and acquisition make sense? Well, we were very aware of Xterity in the market, but, but oddly enough, uh, we haven't really bump, bumped heads with each other. We sell to uh, IPTV to different types of customers. So um, from a customer point of view, um, nothing changes right away, but ultimately we're going to have a converged platform, uh, a converged solution to offer to customers. Um, geographically speaking, um, VTech has been very strong in IPTV in, in the Americas, specifically North America. Um, as Colin will attest to, um, Xterity's strengths as far as geography has been in Europe and in Middle East and Africa. Um, so I think that the combination of the company is, is really a, a true marriage in a sense that um, there are strengths for both sides that complement each other, um, to both geographically and from an uh, offering point of view. Ultimately, um, the solutions will be converged and will be offering the best from both companies to customers. So I, I really see it as a win-win uh, long-term uh, for, for customers, for sure. Colin, Mark made, made mention of the fact that you guys really didn't hit uh, head-to-head in a lot of areas uh, for Xterity and for their customers. Why does this uh, make sense on your side? You know, it's, it's been interesting, Tim. Uh, 2020 was a tough year. Um, Xterity was, you know, despite that, did very well. We're quite successful. And I was looking forward to continuing uh, my uh, Xterity's journey, uh, you know, uh, with the strong, um, the sort of the success that we've had, the strong presence in the market. You know, we really were, uh, you know, looking forward to uh, an exciting future. And then uh, I had a conversation with uh, Philippe Wetzel, who is the chief exec and founder of, uh, of uh, VTech. And, uh, you know, in that conversation, um, it, it suddenly struck me that, the combination of the two companies, as Philippe was outlining, it really could uh, have a, a you know make a huge difference and really have a big impact on, on the market. And so it felt like a really great opportunity, both from a uh, from a, a kind of presence point of view. I think you know we we, we complement each other really well. From a technology point of view, we have a strong set of largely complementary products, which allows us to address you know m- more of the more of the, our customers. Uh, sort of project needs, uh, which which I think is is a good thing, but also you know uh, the combination. I'll get the numbers wrong, so I'll apologise now. But the combination of the companies um, uh, gives us something like I want to say two hundred plus engineers. I think is that right, Mark? Uh, I think and, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, correct. It's it's more than two hundred engineers. More than two hundred, you know, who are all dedicated to IPTV, digital signage, encoding, streaming technologies, 
Um, and that gives us the opportunity to create, not, not just deliver you know, great solutions that we have today, but also uh, be well placed for the future of the market. And so we're able to really embrace and drive forward uh, well uh, as, as technology has evolved and satisfy the needs of our customers. So for me, it felt like a really great fit. Um, and I have to say, I've, I've been now part of VTEC for two months and uh, been really pleased with the way that the integration of the two companies is going, uh, the, the cultural fit between the, the organization. Uh, you know, we, 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 we are making great progress and really pleased with the, you know, the, the outcomes that we've had to date and what I expect to see you know, going forward over the coming months. Mark, you mentioned the fact that, that VTEC has, has been really, really successful in, in the Americas. Uh, Xterity uh, has gotten uh, a lot of, of traction uh, outside of the Americas. They do have some, some traction here. Talk about that, that combination then, uh, and you, you mentioned the converged solutions, uh, not only from an engineering standpoint, I do want to get to that, but also from uh, a, a support and coverage standpoint, whether that be sales or technical support globally now, because you have two organizations who really can cover, you know, the, the earth uh, with an IPTV and digital signage solution. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we have a very strong uh, support team in the U.S., which includes sales and, and technical support. Um, we actually, to speak specifically about the U.S. for a minute, um, we focus in on certain vertical markets where we've had success in the U.S., um, the federal government space, um, uh, also uh, um, sports arenas, uh, sports and entertainment, um, a new area that we're going to broadcast, broadcast, a new area that we're going into is enterprise space, which is an area actually corporate enterprise that Xterity has a, a bit more experience maybe uh, than VTech does. Um, so we benefit from, from that experience. As Colin mentioned, VTech is very much a technology-driven company. Uh, before the acquisition, I think we had well, certainly more than 100 uh, R&D engineers. Um, most of those engineers are in Europe, so we have engineering uh, offices in, in Paris, which is our corporate headquarters, um, in Israel, um, in Germany, and also a, a small team in Russia. So we have uh, quite a, quite a, a global um, uh, engineering team that are working together um, and adding the, the expertise from Scotland and I believe Portugal is also an area where, where there's an engineering center, will be quite interesting. So I covered a lot. Uh, I, I kind of slipped over into, into to Europe and, and engineering, but VTech is very much an engineering-driven company historically, so it's hard for me not to, to, um, to go that direction. Yeah, absolutely. Colin, let, let's talk about that for a second. What does this mean? You, you mentioned the fact that you guys have now combined over 200 engineers. When it comes to the, the actual the, the customers that are that are supporting these these systems, what does that mean to them? Uh, not today, not tomorrow. Obviously, this is this this acquisition is only you know a month or so old. What does yeah. that mean in twelve months' time? What does that mean in eighteen months' time to them? You know, I, I think one of the areas, certainly an area that I'm I'm putting a lot of energy in just now is uh, you know un understanding how our uh, larger corporate customers. Uh, are bringing their uh, facilities together and what things we can do to help them, uh, you know, um, support, uh, you know, the, this, I guess, the evolving workplace requirements where we're having to, you know, more offices, more remote offices, more people working from home um, and help to facilitate more of that. So, you know, the, uh, getting material content, digital signage information out to all these locations effectively. Um, you know, we, we, we benefit from uh, a lot of the broadcast technologies which uh, the, the VTEC team, you know, have developed, which uh, allow us to, um, you know, uh, very effectively extend the, uh, you know, a lot of our XS6 would be kind of existing on a, on a, on a single, um, a single uh, site or location. And although we have customers who will boot that and replicate that in multiple sites, often these are all standalone islands almost of technology. Um, and they're not looking at how they can take material from one location to another and manage that effectively. Um, so, as a, just as an example, um, you know, some of the products, uh, there's, a, there's a great um, uh, uh, channel link product from, from VTEC. This is a simple example that helps us uh, effectively deliver uh, content uh, across multiple sites um, and securing and protecting that content with things like SRT. Uh, and, you know, that type of capability extends the reach of the Xterity solution uh, embraces both types of products uh, to create a, a more complete solution, you know, for the customer. So that's important. 
I think also, you know, uh, the, the reality for us is that uh, uh, technologies around encoding and video streaming are moving forward. People are looking for, you know, higher resolutions, uh, lower bit rates, more effective, you know, management of, of content, um, you know, careful management of who is accessing, who is using. Um, and, and a lot of this sort of very fo you know, forward looking technology is an area where, you know, VTEC has a particular specialization. Um, and, and, you know, we would benefit from that uh, you know, as we're developing, you know, some fundamental IP around all this sort of streaming technologies, which uh, ultimately benefit our customers, um, you know, use their network more effectively, manage all this content, which is, um, you know, out there, which they, they want to make, take advantage of, but equally don't want that content to overwhelm the, overwhelm the networking and compute resources within the, within the organization. So, whole range of things that you know we we start to to be able to do and do more effectively for our customers yeah absolutely mark uh really quickly what what how does this change if anything uh go to market strategy for for you two as as a group right as as you guys as vtech brings exterity in under uh under the the umbrella but also how does it change uh if it does the go to market strategy for your customers the folks that are that are deploying and selling these solutions um, I think that at the end, there's going to be a lot more support for them uh, to deploy the solutions, um, both in the Americas and in Europe. Um, we have a pretty big team already in Europe, VTech, and the, the addition of uh, Xterity team. Um, and in the U.S. as well, we have a pretty big team in the U.S. supporting VTech, and now we have, uh, we, we've uh, we brought on some Xterity folks that were in uh, Xterity Inc., the U.S. office, who've uh, converged with, with our U.S. team. So I think uh, just having a, a larger organization to support the customers um, is, is a pretty big deal. Um, again, we have quite a few field application engineers in the U.S. Um, and support engineers. Um, and we have different programs that we'll probably adopt for Xterity in, in, uh, in the U.S. and probably as well uh, globally. So um, I think it's all overall a positive thing. Uh, very good. Gentlemen, thank you so much. Colin Parker uh, from VTech now, uh, formerly we know you know. Exterity of VTech. Exterity by, by VTech. Is it by VTech or of VTech? Uh, a VTech company. All right, a VTech company. Well, Colin, thank you so much, sir. How do people still connect with you uh, or they want to learn more about uh, the Exterity side? So today, still connect with Exterity through our website, www.exterity.com. All right, very good. Mark, uh, very nice to meet you, sir, uh, even though it's virtually. I'm sure at some point in the next five to ten years we'll meet somebody in, in person. <laughs> um, uh, how do people get a hold of you or, or VTech? Uh, www.vtech.com, V-I-T-E-C. All right, thanks, Mark. Thanks, Colin. Uh, for us, for Aviation, go by our website, avianation.tv. That's avianation.tv. Find programs like this and a host of others, including our two weeklies. One is called AV Week. Looks at the commercial side of the AV industry, and the other is Resi Week. Looks at the residential side. All that and more at avianation.tv. That's avianation.